congratulations to last week's Highlight of the Week winner, Jada Krennic, Park Rose High School, for a 25-yard strike. Nominees this week include student athletes from Sherwood, Oregon City, Lake Oswego, Milwaukee, and Park Rose High Schools. Our first nominee, Duncan Atwood, Lake Oswego High School Soccer. Oregon City dials up a long-range shot, but Atwood is equal to the task, notching an amazing save out of the top corner. Our second nominee, Keegan Lawrence, Sherwood High School Football. Lawrence takes the handoff outside to the right, where he drives up field and cuts across, taking it 74 yards for one of his four first-half touchdowns. Our third nominee, Randall Sam, Milwaukee High School Soccer. Five minutes left in overtime. Milwaukee up 2-1. to one. St. Helens with a free kick in the offensive third. The Milwaukee defenders are unable to clear the ball, and Sam comes to the rescue with a spectacular fingertip save. Our fourth nominee, Trevon Bradford, Oregon City High School Football. Grant punts the ball from inside their own 20-yard line out across midfield. Bradford receives the punt at his own 47-yard line, finds a wall of defenders and reverses the field before cutting up the middle, taking it back outside to the right. Once more he reverses the field, spinning away from a tackle. He finds a crease and breaks outside to the left, pushing up the sideline before he's ridden out at the three yard line for a 50 yard punt return. Our fifth nominee, Marshawn Edwards, Park Rose High School Football. Quarterback Jonathan Bolden takes the snap and delivers up the middle, where Edwards brings down a superb one-handed catch and drives it down inside the Sherwood 10 yard line. Our final nominee, the little halftime goalkeeper. At halftime of the Oregon City Lake Oswego soccer game, we see a flash of future greatness with this penalty kick save. Vote for your favorite highlight on the Replay Locker Facebook page. Let's take a look at downloading full game footage from the Replay Locker app. To find an event online, click the search button. If you've been in before, you will have recent teams. If not, click on Find Teams. Now you have the option of entering in search criteria, starting with State. For this instance, we'll use the State of Oregon. After entering all of your criteria, click the Search button to narrow your results. For this video, we'll take a look at Milwaukee Varsity Football. This screen shows all the events the team has participated in this season, We'll take a look at Sherwood at Milwaukee. You have the option of viewing highlights only or the entire game. For this demo, we'll look at full game footage. Once the plays have loaded, you can tap on the picture to change the thumbnail to help you locate your play. Let's take a look at this one. Tap the play button and the first view will load. Once the play starts, tap the play all button in the corner to start downloading the next play. Once it's finished loading, it immediately starts the next play, allowing you to view the entire game in a fraction of the time. To view a different angle, simply tap the screen. You can then touch on the view you want and wait for it to load. When you find a play worth saving, tap the red button and it will be downloaded to My Highlights. Plays stored in My Highlights are saved to your device so you can view them anytime you'd like, even without an internet connection. For more information, visit replaylocker.com.